I think that they learned more culture tonight about Scotland, especially the song The Rowan Tree, which was proved very popular. And also, you can't you shove your granny off a bus. The thing I enjoyed most today was a fiddler. I haven't seen her in, what, 10 years? And then, so to bump into her today and see her acting and playing like that she was, it was amazing. <laughs> Everybody in the community came together, almost spontaneously it seemed, and everyone was so engaged in the performance, and there's a big spread of age in the audience, from very tiny young people right up to people in their 80s and 90s. And every single person was enjoying it so much. You really could see when the, when the old favourite songs came up, everyone was really foot tapping, clapping hands, and everything, which was great. First, I was a bit homesick. It's just so different from the busy, busy city of Aberdeen. And he was to come back to Dundee and we were to get married in 1956. 18 when I came here, so, and I'm 83 now, so what's that? I came to Colby when I was three years old because my parents came down here from Scotland and my dad came down here to work. I was only 14. 1955. I've settled down, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go back. I like Corby and that's it, it's my hometown. It's my hometown. It's my hometown. Home. 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 It's important that the people born in Corby know the Scottish heritage. 
especially through the songs. Thank you. 